Hey. Yes. Did you try to jailbreak your iPod? Yeah. Did you try to put Winterboard on it? Yeah. Why? Well, there's no reboot. Yeah. Really? So cheer up, emo kid. What if I don't want to? Cheer up. Yeah. Yeah. No smart mouth me. Don't. What if I don't want to? What if I don't want to cheer up? Now there's that... an easier way to install Winterboard without really? rebooting it. You can find all that out in this video by I assist you, teaching you exactly how to do this. Okay, I'll watch it. Tubers. It's I assist you here, and I'm going to show you how to install a Winterboard without having to reboot your iPod. I figured this out pretty much on myself by playing around with some of the settings. So let's go through it step by step together. First off, you're going to open Cydia. You have to have a t jailbroken 2G iPod Touch for this. Sorry guys, if you don't have it jailbroken, it sucks for you. So first, as you know, the jailbreak is tethered, meaning you can't turn off your iPod. Well, no worries. First off, what you're going to do is you're going to go to search right down there. Now it's going to load up this page. Now you type in the little search bar, S, oops, S, B, settings. Click search and scroll down to the S's. So there it is. SB settings. Tap on that and go ahead and click install. I'm not going to click reinstall because I already have the package. So once you install that, what that allows you to do is this. When you swipe your finger over the top bar right where the clock is, this comes down. Yours is going to look a little different because I installed a theme for mine. But this is going to be what we use. So make sure you have this. It is vital. I have personally, just for you guys, gotten rid of my winter board. Now, you're going to open Cydia. Wait for it to load. And make sure your iPod is fully charged for the, to do this. Now you're going to click search. Go into the search bar and type in winter board. W-I-N-T-E-R-B-O-A-R-D. It's all one word. See that? Well, no you don't, but, as you know, it's all one word. Now, I'm going to scroll and find it. Right there, see it? Winterboard. Click on that, you see it right there, it says Winterboard, tap install. Now, be sure to follow these steps incredibly carefully and do them along with me. Hit confirm up in the corner. Now it's going to start downloading, let it do that for you. A little bar is going to pop up that normally says return to Cydia. Do not push it. See how it says reboot device? Just watch. Do not push that button. What you're going to do is you're going to go into your SB settings by sliding over the bar. Bring down the menu and push the respring button. Now it's going to bring you to this. It's going to set this. It looks like it's turning off, but don't worry, it's not. Give it a minute. And there you go. You have Winterboard. You can go ahead and open that up. And here's a bunch of themes that are already on it. If you want to add more, simply go to Cydia. Wait for it to load. Tap Search. Now search themes. Now some themes don't need Winterboard, but most do, so this is where it comes in great handy. Now say I want, oh I don't know, let's find Hummer. Say I want the Hummer theme. Now if I want it, I can tap on screenshots to see exactly what it looks like. Let's see. Okay, so maybe I like that. 
Now let's scroll up to the top, go back to the details, and tap install. Confirm the install of Hummer, and it will download your uh, theme. And that's all you need to do. Once it's done downloading the theme, as you will see it's going to be done soon, <coughs> give it a minute, tap return to Cydia. Now, all you have to do is hit the home button, open up Winterboard, and here's your new theme at the top. Now I want that. I can click home. It will do this. It might freeze for a minute, don't worry. It will reload the page and send you straight to your lock screen. And now you have a brand new theme. I hope this tutorial helped. Don't forget to favorite it comment it, rate it, and subscribe. I really hope this helped you guys. Did it help you? Tell me right down below. And if it really did help you and you really liked it, click the subscribe button. Thank you. Bye.